So guys, today's video is all about the depiction of what a high intensity circuit training workout looks like. This workout is primarily designed for intermediate athletes but you can try it too. So let's just get started. So the first two exercises have to be performed on a reverse bosu. And the main purpose of using a reverse bosu while performing these two exercises is to get your core engaged. The most major prerequisite we need to take care of is that we need to get our core engaged while performing a HIIT workout otherwise it is of no use. So you can see now I'm gonna perform double kettlebell swing, double kettlebell because I want double engagement. And now to add some explosiveness we're gonna perform clock push-ups and not the general form of push-ups. Since we're using more number of muscles than we used in the previous exercise to carry forward our workout. We can say that the level of our workout has increased. And now time for some box jumps. This exercise needs a hell lot of focus and boosts your cognitive skills. Now this is my variation of farmer's box so that I can increase the level of my workout by engaging more number of muscles and also it works as a warm up for the next exercise that I'm gonna perform. Just gonna put some more strain on my already damaged muscle fibers so that I create a metabolic moisture effect from this workout. Time for another cognitive booster as well as an endurance booster exercise. You can also use this exercise to travel across two buildings just in case you're stuck somewhere. <laughs> just kidding guys, we've got to perform this exercise just to have some more muscle activation. This is the last exercise of the circuit. It is gonna act as a finisher on your core engagement, muscle engagement and explosiveness. Perform 4 to 5 rounds of the circuit and you'll be great to go. I hope you guys enjoyed the circuit and now are fully pumped and excited to try this in your next workout.